Uh, hi, hi, my name is uh, Peter Zaharadas. I'm the owner of Sugar Cube, a dessert and coffee bar here in Long Island City. This is a pretty intense production in here. We make uh, chocolates, uh, individual desserts, and gelato. And I use uh, my architectural background to introduce a lot of themes in uh, form making uh, with the desserts themselves and, uh, and the chocolate, uh, especially my chocolate bars. Everyone asks me, how do you go from architecture to, to dessert? Uh, what's the connection? For me, it, it, I feel like they're more, more connected than anything else. They, they both have to um, combine different things, different elements, different ingredients to, to create something that, that has a theme. Uh, in the end, it has to have a form. This kind of work itself like basically has a narrative. Uh, in this piece, it represented uh, a family, a mother, her husband, who came from uh, a distance away and their son represents, represented by the sphere itself. So this was kind of like an abstract composition to represent uh, an idea, uh, cryptic, cryptically or symbolically. Um, everything starts with a sketch. So um, I do my geometric studies like these, trying to find a pattern that uh, can repeat without being symmetrical. We're talking mathematics here, uh, geometry, broken into quadrants and then uh, organized into repetitive patterns that create new patterns. So this started as a sketch itself, and then it goes into my 3D software where I model it, print it, and it becomes the, the prototype. So this was printed in the, in the shop, and then I made a mold of it, uh, a box, uh, poured my food grade silicon mold over it, and, and got the negative. Inside, I brush uh, like an edible gold uh, dust to enhance and kind of in, uh, um, kind of lighten up some of the features, and then pour chocolate into this. When you temper it, the, the you know a bond occurs, and then you get like a like a metallic finish. So that's the final product. 